Who's your favorite head ass? So, oh. Hello, Twitter. Uh, so today I'm in my bathroom. Shout out to my... I was gonna say beach towel, but I'm not at the beach. Shout out to my shower towel that I wipe my ass on. Is that a shit stain? Anyways, um, today I'm doing a makeup kind of thing. Really excited. I don't know why I always talk with my hands like this. Uh... So, today I'm going to see the BTS Love Yourself Tour in Seoul movie. Yeah, I went to see their movie before this and it was really good, so I'm really excited to see this one. Anyways, I'm going with Olivia and Caitlyn. Olivia just got back from college. That bitch literally left <laughs> for two weeks and we were bawling our eyes out when we had to say our goodbyes. <laughs> two weeks and she's already back <laughs> so I'm doing a makeup tutorial kind of video no I don't have my own queen makeup palette or my own makeup palette f f focus on me basically it says Ashley in cursive okay and Olivia made this for me for Christmas and oh, the reason it is queen inspired even though it says my name on the front is because the inside has a surprise it is one word and that word is ayo so this is the AO palette. It's so wonderful. It has so many beautiful shades. Also, the names on the palette were not chosen by me. This is not a sponsored video, by the way. Um, I wish it was. This company right here. You can make these on their website. And I think this one was $20. You just choose what colors you want. You can't rename the colors. So like if I wanted to name, oh honey, I don't know what size is your cock, you know, in real Freddy fashion. I couldn't do that because that's illegal. <laughs> okay, let's begin. So, you know, something that I've done this year that is shocking, taking care of my skin. If you've been around for a couple of my makeup tutorials, you will know that most of the time when I want to wash my face, I use, you guessed it, hand soap, which is so great for your skin, really dries that shit up and makes it flaky. But I have really oily skin, so honestly, it didn't even do anything to my skin because I'm an oily bitch. So first we're gonna clean our face before we do our makeup because I never used to do that because again, I'm disgusting. Olay Gentle Clean Foaming Cleanser. Come on, sweetie, focus. Oh, I feel like a beauty guru. I don't know her. I believe I got this from CVS. I'm a cheap bitch, you know, like I'm all about those drugstore products. Putting this on with my old ass Scooby. No, ma'am. <laughs> This looks like I wiped my bleeding vagina on it. Um, no, ma'am. What the hell? This used to be Scooby Doo. You can't even see him anymore. He's right there. Oh my god. No, ma'am. Boy, this is something else. I am so sorry. Okay, I'm gonna get a different towel. This is embarrassing. You know what? We're just gonna use this white towel that I never use because it's white and clean, and I'm not white and clean. Well, I am white, but I'm not clean. Beautiful, okay. So I'm gonna wet this, get it nice and moist. And I'm gonna apply this on my face. It's running out. Um, mm, I'm cheap and don't wanna buy more, so. I'm just gonna, you know, put this shit on my face. I'm just gonna put this on my face, um, turn into Santa Claus real quick. Uh, Roger Taylor is quaking. Look at this dude. Also, don't mind all of my zits. Uh, Mother Nature hates me this month, so. <laughs> About to look like one of those bitches in the Neutrogena commercials. Are we ready? This sounds like a porno, dear God. I am sorry. Ugh. Okay, now that my face is dry and focused, oil free moisturizer. I got this at CVS as well. Put it on my face um, because it's winter time, you know? And even though I'm oily, I need some help not be crusty. I have a booger in my nose. Oh! Ooh, awesome! Booger! Is it gone? This is the true match. Uh, 
it's from CVS. Again, everything's from CVS. So I don't have eye primer. Um, we all know this. I need to get some because right now I'm using foundation as my primer, which is pretty illegal in the beauty guru world. I'm just gonna put this on my eyelids and my forehead. Does anything I do have like reasoning? It honestly is just like whatever happens, happens. If it looks good, great. If it doesn't, cry about it later, you know? Next, we're doing eyebrows. Um, this is the Ardell Professional. I think this is for eyebrows. Wow, we love an in-focus queen. <sighs> Am I a beauty guru yet? It hit pan. I don't know, I usually nine times out of 10 hate my eyebrows. Um, can I be honest? The biggest reason I probably hate them is because I like never do them. Oh my God, that pimple just grew like five times its normal size in a matter of seconds. And then after I fill in my eyebrows, I'm gonna take this musical theater makeup kit that I got when I was a senior. Um, hi, I'm Ashley. It's been almost two years since I've graduated. Can you tell? No, ma'am. And I'm just gonna take this one that looks like a tornado happened um, in it. I'm gonna, you know, conceal these bad boys because girl, they look in thickums. Let me just say, I've already shit once today because of this. A second shit is brewing as we speak. Ooh. -hoo. All right, that was intense, ladies and gents. I just want to say that I want to mention something that I haven't really mentioned on this YouTube channel. I have mentioned it on Snapchat, mainly Snapchat and Twitter, honestly. It's the whole situation about the Sundance Music Festival playing a Michael Jackson documentary that claims that Michael was a child molester. I haven't really spoke much on that. It's not because I don't care. I, I do care a lot. I kind of wanted this to be a surprise, but at this point, I think I'm just going to let you guys know because so many people have asked me to make a video about these situation with the Sundance Film Festival and I just want to say that I am planning on making a series based off of what's going on and planning to release it in June. It's going to take a lot of work and I want you guys to participate in it. Like I'm going to ask you guys to send me videos of you talking about how Michael has impacted your life, you know? Why you believe Michael's not guilty. I will have one part dedicated to how I got into Michael, what he's done for me, what he's done for you guys, and then I plan for the second part to be a whole video just showing facts and literal proof that Michael is innocent, showing court documents, things like that. It's going to be awesome. It's just gonna take a lot of work. But yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I know many people have been like, you know, why has Ashley, she's such a big fan of Michael, why is she not talking about it? I have been talking about it, I just haven't been talking about it on YouTube. It will be talked about on my YouTube, trust me, because I feel like I can make the most impact with what I say and do on YouTube because that's how most people know who I am. You know what I forgot to do? My setting spray. I got a new setting spray actually. It's NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray. Let's try to focus. Somebody come get her. It's supposed to help you look non-oily, but I don't know. I didn't see too, too much of a difference. I'm gonna go ahead and spray this, actually. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Shuki's like, girl, my face matte for life. You just sprayed the shit out of me. <laughs> Once I let that sit a little bit, we're gonna go ahead and put on some powder onto my eyeballs and my forehead. This is uh, also True Match. It's the matching powder. Again, CVS. I'm gonna take my angled, I, they, I think they call this a crease brush. Truly don't know, but I'm gonna use this light shade. We're gonna just put this in the crease. All right, now we're gonna take papaya and we're just gonna put that over what we just put on our trays. It is so hot in here. Ooh. And then we're gonna take Oh Honey and we're gonna put that in our crease as well. Yeah. Yeah. Next, I'm gonna itch my tits. Um, whether you got man boobs, you know, girl boobs, like, do you just itch in between your boobs? Because me, it's okay. <laughs> We're gonna do our eyelids. Gonna go in with this shade, rose gold, right here, you know, it's gonna be all shimmery and fun, so get excited. Any shimmery colors, I really do love them, but they just tend to get everywhere. It still gets on my face, so I don't put foundation on the rest of my face, and that's why, like, I only did it on my eyes and my forehead. It just gets all of my foundation, and it's like, hello, my name is Edward Cohen. All right, and now I'm just gonna put some of that Oh Honey under the, oh, and by, I totally forgot to mention this. I put the rose gold in the inner corner of my eye and like 
right around here. And now I'm gonna take the Ohani and put it on the outside of my eye, like so. You probably shouldn't use this kind of brush for that, but like I'm doing it anyway, cause I'm once again out of control. I got into something a little fun. I have been experimenting with blue eyeliner. So this is Master Kajal Girl. I don't know, but it is Maybelline New York. Kind of like an oil pastel kind of feel. I don't even know how to explain. I'm just gonna put that on my waterline. Next, I'm just gonna put some mascara on. Um, oh my god, sweetie. Are you absolutely shitting me? Oh my god. What do they put in this? Fake eyelashes. These are not from Sephora, actually. They are these. I got these at Ulta. They are the Lux Silk Effect. I don't even like oh my. and the lash glue I use is also from CVS this is the best lash glue this duo lash glue it's just it's good glue it kind of smells like period blood which is so great the smell goes away once it dries on like period blood what is wrong with me I am actually disgusting alrighty I got both of my lashes on this one's still kind of drying you see it a little? Yeah. I, I think the blue does make a difference. I don't know. What do you guys think? Um, hello, my name is Alien. Um, so now I'm gonna put on foundation on the rest of my face and then I'm gonna contour and all that fun stuff. The digital release has already happened of Blow Wrap. I am so excited. You best believe I'm gonna get that on Blu ray. Right now I'm contouring. I'm using the Tarte, a real top, Tarte Glow Palette. There's highlighters in it, but there's also. But anyways, it's called Sculpt. And then I'm gonna do my nose as well. I just started contouring my nose and like, I really like it. I don't know why, I just do. Your girl got a double chin, nine out of 10 times. So just to make sure that doesn't happen as much, I'm gonna contour under my chin. Next, we're gonna highlight with this fun feather brush. I was so excited when I bought this. And we're gonna go in with the color called Stunner. It's right above Sculpt. Ooh, it's popping. I had to get my chapstick out of my Fanny pack. You better talk to her before I do. I don't want to be crusty. Yeah. This is Clinique and girl. <gasps> oh, they're so tiny and cute. Look at them. I'm missing one. I think it's in my purse. Whoops. What is this? This is Clinique Chubby Stick Moisturizing Lip Color Bomb. And it's in the shade Voluptuous Violet. Ooh, it's a little light. I don't know. Now I'm gonna use a curling wand to do my hair. Some people have asked me like, what do I do with my hair? Since I've let it grow out, this is like my natural hair. It's pretty curly. I do plan on actually cutting the blonde part off soon. I might actually get bangs. I'm not really sure yet. Just wanna say, these are gray hairs. <laughs> yeah, love that. Turns out my hair is going gray, so. All right, Woo! I'm just gonna run my hands through them curls, ladies. I'll take sections like probably that big, curl it like this. I curl it away from my face. And you wait, you don't wanna end up like that girl that like left it on so long that her hair fell off, but you know. And then I just brush it out. And that's pretty much how I do my hair. It looks a lot shorter when it's curly. All right, we ready? So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you're going to the BTS movie, I hope you have fun. I'm really excited. I know I have a shout out this week. Give me five seconds. The shout out this week, I hope I pronounced this right. I think I'm going to. I think it's Lakeisha Flowers on Snapchat. We've talked a couple of times. I need to start talking to you on Snapchat more, to be honest. Um, And just, I love you and thank you for supporting me. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you want more like makeup kind of videos. I know I'm not a guru. I don't have the best like up close shots. Um. But you'd probably see my boogers in my nose, so like I don't really want to do that anyways. Just let me know if you want more, and I will see you guys next video. Bye guys, love you! Just wanna say thank you God for this.